What's up everybody, Also Outdoors back here today for another video. Today we are testing out the Abu or not the Abu Garcia, the Whisker Seeker Tackle Rods, the uh, Chad Ferguson uh, one piece medium heavy rods. Uh, I wanted these because they're longer than my Abu Garcia Catfish Commandos and I was already launching baits with those so these I've already tested them out a little bit. They've got a big or a really strong backbone, they got a really firm tip and they absolutely launch baits which is what I needed. Uh, also, it completely just manhandles catfish, so um, I tested out a 6 or 8 ounce uh, weight on it. I casted it and it handled it fine, which is my Abu Garcia catfish commandos couldn't even do that. So whenever I'm using it on the big river on the boat this year, it's just going to be easy. Um, I wanted to uh, start incorporating my gear and stuff into the videos now because, I don't know, you guys seem to like it more, uh, it gets more... Uh, views and stuff uh, my highest video got 10k views um, as of now and it was a review uh, not a review but a test testing out a new product so you guys stay tuned I'm gonna go on the river today test these things out I've got catfish special on here the whisker sugar Chad Ferguson medium heavy rod and or not medium heavy heavy rod and yeah we're gonna go test them out hopefully get on a fish that's pretty dang good size I can't wait to go I haven't really been able to go out on the river much because of like transportation wise but yeah you guys stay tuned this is gonna be a pretty good video hopefully that's the uh, rods reason I got three of them for Christmas because of a really good Black Friday deal stay tuned Like this? Yeah. Perfect. And then you always take that scale off. And you're set. Now you get to cast it. Remember how to cast these? Oh god. Have PTSD from that? Yeah. Fifth time's a charm. Oh god. That's not fun. You got it, you got it. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, cast that. Should I reel it in? I already messed up. I already messed up. No, but. Okay. Should I reel it in? Reel up, yeah. Like there? Further. Yeah, that's good. Then cast it like straight out from you. Don't cross my line, you have one job. I mean, yeah, leave that. That's actually a pretty decent cast. And then you're gonna and then set it down. Push this in. And push this down. So then you have the bait clicker on. And then just lay it down. And you're good. Perfect. Good job. All right, y'all. So as you can tell, those things literally launch baits if you want them to. Um, we're here at the pond on with my girlfriend. Uh, the river wasn't open because of all this coronavirus crap, and we couldn't get in there to park unless we had a boat. So we were going to fish on the river there, but we couldn't. And then we ended up going down this road and got stuck, and uh, it was just a really bad road. So... Anyways, we're here. We got, we're got we using bluegills bait. We're just trying to catch a catfish or two. Uh, it's about 8 o'clock. The sun's going down right now, and it'll probably be dark pretty soon here, but we're just going to see what we can catch. But anyway, those rods, they really do get fling baits out there. Um, uh, there's a ton of backbone. I love them. And the 7 foot 6 rods are really nice, so that's what I needed. Um, I got them all paired with these big old reels and yeah I'll see you guys hopefully whenever we catch a fish can I grab it? 
Should I grab it? It's a good one, I think. Dude, this feels like a really good one, or he's wrapped in something, or it's a turtle. Why does it feel so heavy? I've never felt. Why does it feel so heavy? When it bit on, I was like, it's a turtle. I don't know why. I think he's wrapped on something, honestly, unless he's a huge fish. So he, don't. This is either a really dang big fish or he has a tree with him. Well, get him out. Right? Oh, it's a turtle. That was a massive catfish. I'm getting them in. Oh, yeah, you have to. Is this the one you caught? Probably. Oh, this is kind of cool. I'm glad we could put the freaking whisker rods to this test here. To the test. All right. Set that camera down and set it up, okay? Because I'm going to need you to help me with this. I don't want to. Yeah. I'm not going to. You gotta pull them up a little further if you can. I don't wanna slip in here. It's a dang monster. Got a dang turtle, guys. Freaking awesome. Oh my god. You get a picture of me. All right, guys, this is dang freaking 25 pound turtle right here. Got on the whisker seeker tackle rods. Didn't get a cat today, but got this guy. Gonna go get him, release him. Oh man. There he goes. Holy crap. Good thing I did not work out before this because that freaking hurt. My arms hurt. All right, well, that's a pretty good demonstration of how the whisker trigger tackle rods held up to that. Like, probably is probably good 20 pound turtle, maybe bigger, give or take 20 though. Um, I'll probably since since we didn't catch anything, we're about to leave probably because it's getting cold and um, we just haven't got a single bite from an actual fish. We're probably about to leave and but yeah. That was a good demonstration of whisker seeker, whisker seeker tackle rods. Um, I'll put in some extra clips of us catching fish on them. So you guys stay tuned for that. And yeah, yeah. Thanks, thank you all for watching. Outside or out, peace. Take it, take it. Don't matter. No, don't let tension. Dude, you gotta reel up, dude. It's on. It's on. No, you don't set the hook. You just reel up. Okay, okay. Make sure that that. Uh, yeah, make sure you don't let the line get loose, dude. Make sure it doesn't get loose, okay? Screw the challenge, you get the first fish. <laughs> don't let that line into this one. right here there you go Drake's first catfish of the year one to zero but technically I guess you could say it was mine but not really because he reeled it in so I feel so awkward with the people behind us. There he goes. Straight back. Good stuff, buddy. Little knuckle. <laughs>